happen. It's it's always unfair. It feels wrong for athletes. So it's good that the wind seems straight. You're synchronized very well, and the person in the back is steering the best they can. Yeah. Okay. Well, we've got the lineup. We have Moldova, Germany, France, China, Cuba, Ukraine, Hungary, Canada, and Poland in the final of the C2 Women 500 meters. So the start underway, and unsurprisingly, it is the Cubans with that choppy, powerful stroke. These long-levered Cubans who get away very well um, from the start. They're in the center of your picture. Right next to them, just four from the top of your picture, is the Chinese, really latching onto those strokes already. They're going well, so we've got Cuba, we've got China, and we've got, just stalking them at the minute, the Ukrainians. So it's early days at the moment, just maybe the Canadians keeping their power to dry. They're very, very smooth, you know, they'll hope to come perhaps with a late charge to this race. Great drone shots, we can see there, picture of the Cubans, but the Chinese, as they've shown in the earlier rounds, really beginning to dominate this one. The Chinese are usually super strong throughout the, the race, so there's no catching them up unless they, they get really tired. So right as of now, they're in the lead and they probably are to stay there. Yeah, and it, it must have given them so much confidence to, to really dominate the rest of the field. They were three or four seconds ahead of everyone else in the earlier rounds. Good to see Hungarians, a young Hungarian crew, really putting in a burn there and uh, looking well, looking good together. So this will be an interesting one. So it's a fairly recent Hungarian crew that did win the Hungarian trials, did very well there. They're looking to put the Chinese under pressure. So maybe the Chinese are getting tired. Who knows? We've got, what, 20 seconds left perhaps from now. Still a good margin, though, as we pan out. We can see the Hungarians, they may be coming, but they've still got a lot to do. It's the Cubans right next to the Chinese that really struggled. Ukraine is beginning to pick it up. As the camera pans out, we should see. There it is, the white bow of the Ukrainians being stalked, stroke for stroke, by the Hungarians. They're not going to take the win away from the Chinese paddlers. They do look tired. They look as if they're languishing a little bit now, but they've done enough early on. It's going to be China who take the gold. They were the, very much the favorites. The Ukrainians using every ounce of their experience to get the silver. Hungarians, bronze, and the Ca Polish Canadians not far away from the medals, whereas the Cubans really did struggle over the last 100 meters. The Chinese can be um, very, very satisfied with their work because